uh, reported a load of potholes on National Pothole Day. Uh, one just behind me um, that was filled quite quickly. The fill wasn't the worst, certainly wasn't the best because it wasn't jointed and lo and behold it's all blown out next to that fill um, because water's penetrated and broken up the next section of tarmac down. On this bend Shropshire Council came out to mark the road as a, a job to be done. Again reported it back in on National Pot all day. Um, Shropshire Council then came out yesterday. They've done their fill but they've filled it with absolute rubbish. It's their best pudding fill which won't last for two minutes and uh, be lucky to last the week. Cows when they've gone for milking um, stood on it and left their mark on it. Uh, lorries going around the bend already have scrubbed it up. Um, it's still soft as anything. You can poke it with your foot, even your finger. It's just absolute shit. Excuse my French. Really, that's just so far below what's acceptable standard. Um, you need to get a grip. Yesterday I came out to do a video of a pothole repair on the bend just round the corner. Uh, rubbish repair. But they managed to do that on Wednesday and then there are three potholes here that they didn't repair at all. Um, which was bad enough. Today they've been out, two days later, and they've repaired two potholes there. And they've now missed the third pothole over there. Um, if you can explain to me how that's good value for money. Um, you've had one bloke come out to site to assess the size of the potholes. You've had at least two people presumably come out to fill potholes on the bend and back here um, on two separate days. So that's at least five people to fill um, potholes. Um, that's just a complete waste of money. Um, they paid £100,000 to have a pothole consultant come in and sort out how inefficient it was, get extra gangs in, although the extra gangs have come in from all over the place because they're all subbies from Kia. Um, some cases have come hundreds of miles to do a small job. Um, it's just ridiculous, absolutely ridiculous. Everybody's working hard, they're paying a lot of money in council tax, meanwhile Shropshire Council's throwing money away hand over fist on crackpot projects. Um, million quid on the slinky, then you've had three million quid wasted because they've not upgraded the street lights when they could have done. 50 million pounds spent on shopping centres that they had no business buying um, when everybody could see they were going to collapse in value. Um, really it's just um, appalling waste of public money. Um, Shropshire Council should be working for everybody not against everybody. Literally pouring money down the drain doing rubbish like that.